Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Taurus Sun, Moon and Rising. It is the year 2018 and a Happy New Year. Thank you so much for your support, likes and shares. Um, I'm so grateful. This is just so wonderful. This is powerful. Um, this is a time for new beginnings. Um, this is a good year for you, Tauruses. The energy, um, please remember to listen to your sun, moon and rising sign. And please remember to thumbs up these videos and share these videos. It is wonderful. Um, but to keep my channel going um, for you guys. So please share these videos and please thumbs up, likes and shares. Um, listen to your sun, moon and rising sign and also um, listen to the general readings because the general readings are up. There's another reading that is also going to be loaded and that is all about the year 2018 and um, listen to your energy vibration for the earth energies because you guys are the earth energy. So I'm changing up the style of reading. Um, how this is going to be because this is a year of uh, um, huge changes that is coming in is a year that you need to make choices of how you're going to go um, into the year 2013 uh, 2032 so it is all going to happen the year 2018 you have to deal with justice legalities unbalances situations like this that are coming out and these situations are going to be positive situations because what is happening is that you are going to have to deal with legalities it's going to all come out in this year a whole lot of stuff is going to come out in this year because I'm seeing it in a whole lot of readings that um, a lot of information, things that was hidden is going to be coming out. Okay, <clears throat> endings are coming in and um, the energy of debt is coming in, but this debt is going to bring a new beginning to something that is a much, a much, much better and much, much positive. Okay. Um, I'm asking you guys to get pen and paper because I'm going to give information out now that you're going to need for this year. Okay, um, the first half of the year and the first three months of the year, January until March, is going to be very powerful for you. Uh, you begin in January with the energy of the sun. This is powerful. And you have the energy of the lovers. So it's all about relationships, good relationship, good people who you're going to be connecting with in the month of January and February. February seems to be a very lucky month for a, a lot of people um, in this year. You have uh, um, the, the, the fire, the water and the earth energy. So in March, the Empress is going to bring in a wonderful abundance for you. And this is going to be so powerful and so um, 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 so powerful and so um, 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 very, very informative and new things are coming in your life. Okay. As we look at, um, so um, the first thing is that your best quarter is going to be the first quarter. Your best quarter is going to be your first quarter from January until March. The next um, um, month, which is going to be very positive, it is the month of May. A lot of people have been getting, and this is your birthday month, so it's going to be very, very positive. For the people who were born in May, June, um, the Tauruses um, who are coming in in June, um, this is going to be a time when you're going to be finding your true self. It's going to be coming back, okay? Um, so May is going to be a wonderful month. When we look at uh, the energy of uh, um, August, another wonderful month, and I don't know why, but the energy of uh, justice is coming up in August. And if I look at the general energies for August, it is balancing. So balancing and justice coming in. So this is going to be positive for you guys because the general energies are earth energy and justice is coming in. So whatever that was injustice, whatever illegalities, it's going to happen in the month of August. So August is going to be a very good month for you. The other good month is going to be um, 
the other good month is going to be um, November November is going to be an extremely positive month the real of fortune your luck is going to come true in November so this is positive please write this down December is going to be a good month in the sense that a lot of people are going to be learning the energy of the magician comes in um, um, December so you know November and December is going to be good November and December is going to be extremely positive extremely good it's going to bring in a lot of situations in your life so this is going to be positive so um, write these number down for you guys your number is going to be 19 6 3 17 um, 0 the full energy use the number 22 and um, we have 11 we have 10 and we have one so you guys have this you know numbers to use so again we have 19 which is 8 use the 19 8 and then we have 6 we have 17 which is 8 um, 19 is 10 so it's twice the wheel of fortune um, okay I know all right let's do this again we have 10 we have 19 we have six we have three we have seven we have eight we have 22 we have 11 and we have 10 again and we have one so these are going to be your numbers to work with in this year we are now going to go in your readings to show what is exactly happening for you guys in January you have the energy of the Sun January is a powerful month whatever you decide to do it is a goal it is a goal so go for it do it whatever you decide in January to do go for it because this is going to happen for you this is going to be a goal this is going to be a positive positive energy this energy of the Sun is bringing a lot of success from out of the year before um, this this is a positive successful time for you guys so January is going to begin the year on a good positive note as we look at February February you have to deal with the energies of your lovers so not the relationships are going to be coming up a lot of people are going to be connecting with um, um, their good relationships relationships are going to be coming in your life this is a water energy but it's a good good energy because all the cards around it, it is so positive so um, there is not um, this is going to be good relationship in business good relationship in friendship good relationship in partnerships love relationships so this is going to be good February is the month of love for you guys as we look at March we have March as the energy of uh, success, profit, investments. Uh, um, this is good because the Empress is bringing in this fertility of everything that you need to manifest, to move on in your life. And this is going to be good because the Empress is here and she is going to bring in a lot of information, situations, opportunities for you. And this is going to be good in March so let's end cap the first three months of the year the first quarter we have the energy of the sun and the lovers which this is very wonderful a lot of positive relationships are going to be coming in and um, not only positive relationship but your financial abundancy is going to be here for you in the first quarter so in the first quarter January till March is going to be the best for you in this year as we move on to April, we have the energy of the Eye Princess. In April, it's more of a um, listening to your intuition, guidance that is coming in, information that is coming in, um, you connecting with other people because um, what is happening is that your intuition is going to be on a very high note. You are going to be um, on point with a lot of things that has been happening. A lot of information is going to come in and you're going to be really, really, really on point. So this is going to be good this is going to be extremely positive in April 
in may a wonderful positive month is your birthday month and it's going to be bringing you a lot of luck a lot of luck is coming in for you Taurus. this this is your birthday month this is going to be positive this is going to be good there is going to be a lot of positive energies that are coming in your wishes and dreams are going to be coming in for people who were looking for the right relationship positive friendships uh, good business partners this is going to be happening for you so just constantly sending out those positive thoughts to the universe because in may you are going to see these coming in as we move on and we look at june june is an, an uh, the energy of you finding your true in a light you finding your true in a light you are stepping back because the second quarter is going to be a very relaxing quarter where you're going to be just stepping back and you're going to just be focusing on the things on yourself for you are going to, because this is an emotional thing that you're dealing with yourself so in um April you have that and in June so the first half of the year June you're ending June thinking and dealing with situations and accepting yourself for who it is so it's going to be a, um, a good revelation because you're connecting with yourself and you're getting these um, situation in balance so as we recap as the second half is a really you know very quiet but with the quietness that is going on behind the screen your, your wishes and dreams are coming through okay so this um, this we're going to look at the third quarter because the new half of the next six months and these energies just keep on coming up another air sign had that I think it was the Aquarius so if your Sun moon and rising sign is Aquarius or so you're going to have the same energies coming back so obviously the universe is saying something the energy of the tower comes in for you guys in the month of July so a lot of people in the month of July it's a cleansing month It's a month where things are being released from you things that no longer serve you are going to be released from you and this is very positive this is very good this is a positive time for each and every person to connect with themselves and here you are going to see this happening because the tower energy comes to cleanse that which no longer serve you and it's going to move things out of your life so expect that in July August whoever has a legal situation whoever has conflicts this conflict is going to come to an end in August because you have the energy of a balance and earth energy for the the general energies and you have the energy of justice and the energy of the year is also justice so whatever has transpired for you Taurus is whatever that has been happening whether you were working on a positive or a negative sense or a negative influence in your life uh, these things are going to come to an end because uh, the energy of justice comes in in August so you can be on the winning side or you can be on the losing side in September September is a month where a lot of stuff are going to be ending and it's not only for you Tauruses but for a lot of other zodiac energies in September a lot of endings are coming up it's no one dying um, it is endings of situation people um, the sort of a thing issues that has been going on finally the end is going to come in because justice stepped in in the month before and it is going to finally end in the month of September so September see September as a month of endings so as we recap on this um, third half of the year it is all about cleansing it is all about uh, whatever that was injustice and imbalance there is going to come an end into it and once and for all everything will be now removed so that you can choose a new part in your life and this is going to bring you positive energies as we look at the last and third half of the year in October a lot of information is going to be coming out and whatever this information that is coming out you're going to choose a new part whatever information that has been kept or whatever information the tower came and explode and make an explosion because the tower is really removing stuff the tower is really cleansing stuff the tower is really um, 
lifting up the carpet so opening up the closet letting out the truth so the truth for you guys are going to come out in the month of uh, um, October so be aware and be ready for this because whatever information that is going to come out is going to make you decide to choose a new part in your life as we move forward we have in November one of your best best months you have the wheel of fortune this is a very very lucky month for you um, um, for you Tauruses and this is very good because you Tauruses have the Sun and the Wheel of Fortune in your year reading which is a very very positive whatever you decide to do in the month of November go ahead and do it it is the universe saying yes it is a good time to whatever you want to start whatever you want to um, finish whatever you wish for and uh, this is good because you are going to feel the streak of lucky energies bringing you and moving you forward and this is going to be extremely extremely good as we look at December another wonderful wonderful month the, uh, the month of December is going to be with the energy of the magician now the magician what the magician is doing is helping you to begin to make a new start in December it is going to bring you different people situations in your life who's going to help you to move you to a wonderful place a place that you had no idea that could have you could have had this in your life and this is going to move you to a positive positive place in your life and this is going to be so powerful and so good so this is going to be a wonderful time for you guys to really start getting up and making changes for the year 2000 and 19 so as we look back at the, the 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 months from October until December it is actually um, a very informative this is an informative three months that is coming up because whatever the tower had released it's going to bring out a lot of information and this information is going to bring you a lot of fortune and with this fortune you are going to use it to make magic in your life and start end your year 2000 the the, the general year 2000 and starting um, 2019 on a good 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 part in your life so your overall energies your energies for this year 2017 you'll be working with the general energy of justice and and justice with the justice that is coming in it is going to move you to some um, to something new a new part it's going to move you towards a new part in your life and this is going to be very very positive so it's it's taking justice came in to um, uh, you know release whatever information that was kept away and with this information it's going to lead uh, most of you on a new part in your life uh, people are going to do new studies people are going to change their career people are going to think of moving um, th th this is an, an, an you know an innocent move something that is going to come out the blues it's not really going to come out the blues because information that is coming is going to make you decide to choose a new part in your life and this is going to be good and with this new beginning that is coming up uh, for you in this year 2018 it's going to um, take you to a place where you had no idea um, that you could have had all these wonderful things that is about to enter your life and this is going to be extremely extremely good so ladies and gentlemen you Tauruses I am loving your reading because you have the most the first six half of this year is going to be um, extremely good well once your birthday um, comes over you're going to see these energies really appearing in your life and this is going to be um, extremely good because the months are taking in from your birthday because it's like 2017 all the luck that you have in 2017 January February March you are going to see these things transpiring and happening in your life sorry I need to sip because I've been doing this so here we are we are going to go, go and sorry look at the general energies of the zodiac energies to see what the sun rising and the moon people will be working within the year 
of it's a lot of career changes I did say that a lot of career changes and the Sagittarians are coming in to help you and not a fire sign which is very good because the Sagittarians always come in with luck for you Sun people the moon people are going to have to be dealing with Pluto so Pluto is going to change your life and this is why this new beginning is here so uh, let's go and see what happened for the sun people for the sun people these are the people who were born 12 uh, 12 uh, um, uh, 12 a.m. until 6 p.m. so you people what you are going to be dealing with is a lot of career changes a lot of career changes is going to come up this is good it doesn't really matter these career changes because some um, Sagittarians are going to come in your life to help you to make this career move and make these changes and this is going to be good business partnership partners because with you Taurus Sagittarians are very good business partner it's all about business with these Sagittarians uh, for you guys and it, they are going to help you to make a good career move and this is going to be very very positive as we move forward we have the energy of the moon the energy of the moon is very very positive whatever the situation is and was with the energy of the moon you are going to be dealing with Pluto and when Pluto comes in with the energy of the moon I'm gonna look at that for you because you also have your own energy vibration and this is powerful you Taurus so it's a good lucky year but the energy of the moon with Pluto this is going to change things in your life and you just have to deal with the changes because the energy with Pluto the Sun with Mars is always your uh, you have control over your energy how you spend your energy and turn it into good and not anger into revenge okay the moon with um, Pluto because Pluto is a planet whenever Pluto and Uranus come in your life and Mars <laughs> um, be ready Luna with Pluto the moon with Pluto it is a time to retreat into the dark caves of your inner um, sanctuary misty awaits you there oh my god you Taurus is yes because you're an earth sign this is a mysterious year so yes this is what to um, expect so Luna um, the moon in and and, 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 and and it comes up with the Tauruses so you can see that this is what is going to be happening for you guys because um, um, the moon people you are going to be resting and looking within and going in the mysterious world you Tauruses so this is very good because you're not working with anyone else but you're working with yourself going in the unconscious and looking for um, the mystery of life because you're an earth sign and this is going to be good next energy that we have is the ascension card this is good I'm going to be using them because we're going through ascension at this time and let's see what is the message from the ascendance masters for the Tauruses for the year 2018 and we have Orion Orion came up for I think it was the Aquarians so here I told you guys about the Aquarians and um, it's the number 18 um, so Orion is the great master so invite you to visit Orion in meditation or sleep to receive a download of cosmic wisdom this is an honor for you Tauruses because that's why you need to work with Pluto to go in the misty the mysterious world the mysterious world the unconscious world this is an honor so prepare yourself with intention during the daytime by showering light and candle some people have to work so you can't do that for the people who doesn't have to work you can go walk out in nature and um, then the download you will receive these uh, spiritual downloads Orion is the soul star chakra soul star chakra of this universe you may find it helpful to ask Archangel Mallory to lighten up your personal solar star chakra which is above your head so remember you know ask Archangel Michael uh, um, um, Mariel M A R I E L Archangel Mariel to lighten up your um, personal soul star chakra which is above your head and to facilitate connection so 
you can say this affirmation which is I honor the masters of Orion and visit them in my sleep tonight I honor the master of Orion and visit them in my sleep tonight and this is wonderful this is positive this is a good situation good energies that are coming out for you guys I am also working with us the Aztec um, chakra cards these are new these came out in this year the Aztec um, um, is the information is where all the information of every soul in uh, all the universes are and let's see what comes out for you Taurus is the four of roses views of the ego the four of roses views of the ego oh my god yes okay so it's a year where a lot of you are going to be viewing your ego you're going to be looking at yourself in the mirror and you are going to be looking at who you are as a person and you're going to deal with the dark side the shadow side of who you are in this year you Tauruses and that's why the energy of the tower comes out and judgment because you're going to see yourself as who you are but yet still you're going to go on a new journey because you're going to release your shadow self because this is a year where you're going to be moving away from certain situation and certain things in your life we're moving forward with the energy of the conscious spirit the conscious spirit let's see what the energy of the conscious spirit has for you Taurus is in the year 2018 you have transformation and it is it is perfect this is so perfect because your year 2017 is going on a new journey you have the magician in December so it's a huge transformation for you guys I journey within to meet my higher self and to find true happiness <coughs> oh my god this is so good this is a positive reading for you guys transformation I journey within to meet my higher self and to find true true happiness and this is so powerful so wonderful you guys really 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 are going to find this a uh, true inner power that you never knew you had last and final card is the energy of the abundance and let's see what they are saying for your financial situation in the month of two 2018 let's see what is happening um, for you guys um, bountiful nature bountiful nature um, spending time in nature's health shift you in a higher energy vibration and reminds you of God infinity abundancy go outside and enjoy a walk a bike ride uh, or walk with your pet meditate breathe um, hold a tree garden sitting under the stars or do some other activity to connect with the unlimited fullness of the universe so this is going to be a bountiful abundance but once you walk out in nature by walking out in nature this is going to help you to send your message to the universe and it's going to open up and I I, and I knew when I was um, doing this and when I was on my journey it was like you have to walk out in nature but I couldn't you know it was my life was busy and all of this thing but as soon as you walk out in nature and you get relaxed you can you start to know and feel what it is that you're looking for so come back read these cards remember these cards listen to these um, readings again because it's going to be a year of transformation for you guys there is going to be a lot of luck January is going to be lucky whatever you decide in January it's going to be good um, May is going to be a lucky month for you guys it's a yes go ahead um, 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 November is going to be a yes month for you guys so it's going to be very very positive a lot of luck is coming in in um, the month of um, the, the 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 month of um, January so this is going to be extremely extremely positive for you guys so I want to say to each in person um, 
please um, share these readings please subscribe to my channel and um, stay tuned because it's going to be a wonderful positive year you're going to end the you begin the year good you're going to end the year good and uh, most of you are going to have new positive situations coming in your life I want to say to each and every person out there I'm wishing you a wonderful new year I love you namaste until next time